Welcome back to Indie Voice. Today we're diving into Master Blaster. This is not what you think it is. I know you're probably thinking of something very retro, the thing that normally helps you with math. No, that's not what it is. This is a retro inspired action game developed by Lost Cabinet Games. If you're into games with a mix of fast paced action with a bit of chaos, then stick around, this one might be for you. Master Blaster falls into the action slash casual slash indie genre that leans into the heavy arcade style gameplay with an epic yet similar storyline. The universe is in peril and it's up to you to stop the Lord Chaos Bringer, a prime evil entity who has summoned hordes of elemental forces to wreak havoc. As a player, you are tasked with defeating those chaotic forces and claiming the title of the Master Blaster. The story is simple, but it serves its purpose. The charm comes comes from the over-the-top villains, dynamic action sequences, classic save the universe premise that will make you feel like you're playing a game from the golden age of arcade shooters. There are two main modes of play in Master Blaster, survival mode and campaign mode. Survival mode challenges to fend off endless waves of enemies, testing your endurance and reflexes. The campaign mode goes off of a structure, giving you different levels, each with increasingly difficult and new type of enemies. This mode brings into some story elements as you progress towards the ultimate showdown of a Lord Chaos Bringer. Looking at the pros and cons of Master Blaster. Pros, fast paced, engaging combat, stylized retro graphics, challenging but rewarding, and a good amount of replay value. Cons, limited enemy variety, basic upgrades and power-ups, campaign length, it's not that long, but it does take a lot of time. I would say it's in the middle to near short. Depends on how much you go through it all in one day, but players might not like it if they're looking for a longer experience. Master Blaster is a fun, fast-paced indie game title that does a lot with just its price tag of $5.99. It's the kind of game that's easy to pick up but difficult to master, making it a perfect fit for players who enjoy action-packed, chaotic experiences. The retro-inspired graphics and the engaging gameplay loops will definitely satisfy your itch for a classic arcade vibe, though the enemy variety and power-ups could use a bit more depth. Giving the verdict here, I'm giving Master Blaster a solid recommended. It's a great value for what it's offering, especially if you're into retro-style action games. While there are a few areas that need improvement, it is a satisfying experience that will keep you entertained, whether you're aiming to the highest score in survival mode or fighting your way through the campaign mode. That's it for today's review. If you've played Master Blaster before, and let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And as always, don't forget to like and subscribe for more indie game reviews, and I'll catch you next time.